Uh, just picked these up clean out of the state. Uh, these are like early 2000s uh, mini bikes. Like we all remember back when they sold them in uh, pet boards and stuff like that. Uh, the gas ones are probably APC. And then they come out with this yellow one. Electric one. I'm not sure it made by the same company. It probably might be a different company. But that's a early attempt at an electric one. Take a look at the chopper. Well, these are really rare to find in this condition. Uh, most of them all broke up. Uh, they didn't make too many of these. Um, that's a real rare one right there. That's even that's a bigger size bike they made. APC. Uh, it's two stroke. Uh, most of the time, all the flaring cracks up. And there's the Harley type bike right there. Take a look at them. Chrome and garage cap. They'd be cleaned up, been sitting probably for 15 years. Uh, look at that massive uh, hydraulic brake uh, brake setup right there. Got a, got a big decalvary is on it. <laughs> it's only a little two-stroke motor runs these, but they run pretty good. Take a look at the electric one. It's really well made. I never had one of the electric ones, but I've had all these before back in the day. All the millennials and stuff remember these old pocket bikes and stuff back in the early 2000s and 2005. I think it was early 2000. Pet Boys were selling them. A lot of them were around it. They were cool bikes. Had exhaust coming out. Two stroke. Had like a centrifugal transmission down there. Um, it made it pretty powerful. It was actually a good setup. That two stroke motor. They produced a lot of power. I mean pretty good speed. I mean full grown adult. I mean they could be moving 30 miles an hour. You're talking about a little weed whacker motor. <laughs> and they had electric start even. That was a pretty cool setup. They had electric start in these. Turn single horn. This one's a nice bike. Uh, turn singles are broke. It's normally, if you left these bikes out in the rain, uh, they fall apart within a week or so. They would rust up and they're plastic. They're like actual plastic plastic. Not like the plastic you see on cars, but they will crack very easy. These are all in great shape. See, I had a, let's look down here. Had a fake plastic motor. Like, the, I'll show you the other one over there. There's the two stroke motor. Electric pull start, and it's very cool setup there. I don't know why they don't produce this setup no more, but it was a heck of a setup. You don't see them too much anymore. I guess it costs too much money to build these bikes like this. There's a lot went into them if you look at them. Front suspension, rear suspension, disc brakes, double exhaust, chrome. Nice seat, lights, turn signals, horn. So it's a pretty neat bike. Uh, they don't make them no more though, but they do make. I see the pocket rockets they make. You might be able to still order them. I had to look into it. I know they still make them pocket rockets, but they're made a. They're completely junk. They got a different motor on them, little teeny micro motor. But anyway, this is electric start right here. Stars in there. And there's a the pool start. Come over here. Got a little transmission automatic these had double wheels in the back <laughs> look at this one it's kind of oddball one they did make some of these that had a, a four stroke where you could shift gears but this one's got the two stroke Let's take a look really well made bike that's just a quick look at the mini bikes that's just from the early 2000s a lot of them ain't made no more and very hard to find in this condition, so I thought I'd make a video. Thanks for watching.